Hi guys, welcome to this short episode today I'm making. Today I'm going to be just talking about the program mode on a DSLR camera. So at the moment it's a manual, so I'm going to put it into program mode and I'm just going to talk about the features within that particular setting on this Canon, um, Canon 550. So I'm going to put it into program mode. There we go, I think it's in program mode. There we go, I think it's in program, nope, pro there we go, that's in program mode now. So I'm in program no mode now, I'm going to switch it on. And within this setting, you have certain features to access them. Um, so, so if you see the settings here, um, to access those settings, you have to press on this Q button. So if you press this Q button, it will go blue like this. And this will allow you to navigate through the settings and be able to find what you're looking for. So for example, if I want to go to my exposure compensation, I can click on that and then use the dial wheel above here to, um, to control the exposure compensation on this setting. Um, when you're happy, go back to the Q button. And then basically what you need to do is you can just use these buttons here, these sort of navigation buttons, to navigate through, like for example, your white balance, your um, 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 your picture mode, do you want it um, auto, do you want it on standard, do you want it on portrait, do you want it on landscape, do you want it neutral, do you want it black and white, etc. So again, click on Q button, sorry, uh, set that, uh, and then you'll go back to your uh, main menu, or, um, your white balance, so you can change that. And you've got your auto image contrast, if you want to sort of change that as well. You've got your flash firing, so it's got a built-in flash on this one. I haven't got a, um, a flash on the hot shoe, so I don't really need that, to tell you the truth. Um, and your picture size, if I could go into... Sorry, if I go to... Oh, there you go, see, so what I have to do is press the Q button again. And again, it allows me to select whatever feature I wish. So the, in this case, I wanted to change the size of the document. So size of the image. Um, my apologies, ISO, I'm, back, I'm in ISO, so I'm gonna go back. And again, I'm gonna go to image size. And I think here, you just sort of hover through this wheel above and it will change the size of your picture, megapixels and the size of the document. Um, Spot metering, so you can change that as well. Again, click on this middle set button and select the spot metering, partial set metering, evaluative set metering, or um, center weight, whichever one you prefer and whatever you're taking. So I'll select this one. Um, and then I'll go to the next one, which is single shot or burst mode. So if you're shooting um, lots and lots of photographs, you might want to select that one. So yeah, um, one thing you cannot select is the aperture and the shutter. So um, ISO, it allows you to change. So this particular camera goes to um, of quite a minimal, really, 6,400 ISO. So it allows me to change that, but it doesn't allow me to change the shutter and the aperture. So those two things I cannot change on this particular camera within the program mode setting. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. A few settings in this particular camera in regards to the program mode. Essentially, you can change the file size, spot metering, ISO, exposure compensation, but you can't necessarily change the aperture and shutter. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.